Hi, I'm Neil O'Grady, osteopath, and today I'm going to show you a manipulation for the intermediate cuneiform on the right foot in this case. And uh, you may need to do this when the patient has pain over the intermediate cuneiform. Uh, they may even have a protuberance of the bone and might be um, pushed up in a keflat or superior direction slightly. And the bones, the cuneiforms are like keystones in a Roman arch, sort of wedge shaped and you might just get one that is sitting slightly up and you want to pull it back down slightly uh, and to mobilize and restore motion to that joint by pulling it in a kef ladder inferior direction. So in order to do this first we need to locate the intermediate cuneiform. So we start on Nicola's first or second metatarsal. I work my way up through the metatarsal bone. Okay, so now I can feel the intermediate cuneiform. I'll interlace my fingers over the second or the intermediate cuneiform. I place my thumbs on the plantar aspect of the foot over the relevant metatarsal bone, so that's the second in this case. I'm going to dorsiflex the ankle, so just relax the foot. I'm going to dorsiflex the ankle here to lock up the tib talo joint or the talocleural joint and relax the foot and I'm just going to traction the foot a little bit and what I'm going to do in a moment is a thrust in an inferior direction through the intermediate uh, cuneiform whilst uh, thrusting the metatarsals in an anterior or a superior direction, okay? And adjusting the, inter the intermediate cuneiform. So, like that. Okay, that's it. If you like the video, uh, please subscribe to the channel and uh, see you next time. Thank you.